Hi everyone, it's Helena and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be giving you guys a tour of my pet room and cage tour of the chinchilla's cage. So let's get started. So when you first walk in, um, there's this row of bags. <laughs> um, they're not totally pressed against the wall because I have this tube here that the chinchillas fit in and they love to go in it when they're free roaming. So I'm just gonna go through these bags really quick. Um, I have these natural aspen shavings for the hamster cage, which as you guys know, my hamster buttercup passed away and there's a lot of hamster supplies in here. Um, I'm filming this video like a few weeks before I'm gonna actually upload it. Hopefully I'll have all of this stuff out of here by then, but I'm not really sure if I'm getting another hamster yet. So after that, I have some Timothy hay and then this um, KT Clean and Cozy Bedding. I have two bags of that. Again, I don't have a hamster right now, so don't know what I'm gonna do with that. Um, so I have these dog pads. Um, these are the PetSmart ones, and then these are the Target ones. I put them behind the cage, and then um, when the chinchillas pee, it can catch on them. And then a tiny bit more of the Aspen shavings. And then behind here, I have this Orchard grass hay. Um, it's a very tiny bag of it, but the Timothy hay is a little too like hard for hamsters, so this is a softer version basically. So then we move over here, and this is the chinchilla cage, so I'm just gonna quickly go through that. So the top level looks like this. I just have fleece on it. I have this like a variety of different random toys. I'm not really gonna go through those because they're all just kind of little bits. So there's Piggy, hello. Um, and then I have some food. And then I have this little hay feeder. I got this from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, I got the inspiration from the Chinchilla Notebooks video. She got one of these little things from Walmart and they're not actually for chinchillas or hay or anything. They're for like sticking on the side of a cabinet, but it works very well for hay. And then um, half of these little ledges I made and half of them I bought from the place that I adopted the chinchillas from. So I love having these ledges in their cage. They're really good for chinchillas and they love them. And then this water bottle is just from PetSmart. Um, and then this huge too, I got in the bird section of PetSmart. It's literally ginormous. And then this is also a huge hide. This is literally the best hide ever. It's also from PetSmart but um, I think it's for rabbits. It's a bit pricey, I feel like, but they can literally both fit in here and it just gives them so much space. And um, it's hard to tell on camera how big it is, but yeah, it's definitely the best. And then above the cage, I just have um, this little dustpan and broom for cleaning. And I have this piece of cardboard because um, we have these air conditionings and it's kind of like right above the cage, which we're not really supposed to be doing. So it kind of helps. And it also helps keep it like dark and stuff. So then we move on to the bottom. But down here, I have this um, little shelf and then this big shelf. I Not shelf, I don't even know what I'm saying. On here, I just, there's a ramp going down and then we have just some little toys I got from like, I don't even remember. Hi, Gerald. <laughs> down here, um, it's pretty like, I don't have a ton of stuff down here but I do have tile. So as you guys can see, I have like a lot of random little tiles. So if you guys know of any places to get like tile that fit in the Ferret Nation or the Critter Nation for you, because I've only looked at Home Depot, but I kind of had to piece together a ton of random tile. Oh, I never said what kind of cage I have. I have the Midwest Ferret Nation Model 182. This you guys might remember, you probably don't recognize it, but from my vlog, I'm going to PetSmart. I got this big long tunnel and now it's just this, but I leave it in here and they love to chew on it, huh, Gerald? <laughs> He's frozen, okay. Um, so then I just have these loofahs, which they like to chew on. Um, this little thing, I don't even know what this is, but they love it. And here's, I don't even know, all these little toys. And then um, they have the chin spin, which is definitely the best wheel. Um, it's very pricey, but I love it so much. It's amazing. Gerald loves it too. It's still frozen, okay. Um, and then we have these little pee pads, which I made. Uh, I put them in the corners because that's where they pee the most. And it's really, really helpful because they pee a lot on that corner tile and then it kind of drips down and it just helps everything to have those pee pads. And then I just wash them every week. Oh, 
Oh, sorry, I started filming. He was chewing on that for a second. Um, and then this I also got from the bird section. I love getting kebabs from the bird section because they literally have the best ones ever. And then just some more of these guys and this little hammock, which they don't use very often, but sometimes I will catch them in there. But I also find a lot of poops in here sometimes, so it's evidence that they go in it. This I got from the place that I adopted the chinchillas from. I think she made it herself. Oh, he freezes every time I start filming. There we go. So tasty. And then over here, I just have the trash can and then this little um, organizing shelf that I got from Ikea. I used to use this a lot more, but it's kind of empty at the moment. And it just has some like cleaning supplies right now. And then I have this little pink storage like shelf. So um, in here, I just have some treats for chinchillas and hamsters. It's not very organized in here. I haven't actually looked in here in a while. Then some just like extra fleece and more extra fleece and um, garbage bags. And then over here, my window looks very strange. Um, the chinchilla literally ripped off the wall, like you can see the inside of the wall. So it's pretty bad. Um, so we have cardboard all along the window. And then this is very dusty because the chinchillas after their dust bath always like to go up here. So we made it a little bit like longer with these tiles. And then I have these boxes so that they like to jump up the thing and tile the window. Um, so in this box, I just have some extra hamster food. And this is not a fudge swirl ice cream. It's actually just extra sand for the chinchillas. Um, it came in that box when we adopted them. And then in here, I don't really want to open it because it's just hard to open, but I have this gigantic, gigantic bag of food. That's literally like all that's in here for the chinchillas. They have the hugest bag of food ever. And then if you notice like cardboard around any of the edges of the walls, um, the chinchillas like to chew the wall, as you can probably tell. So that's why that's there. So then over here we have my hamster cage. <laughs> Don't worry, I um, am not this bad of a hamster person. I literally, my hamster is not living in here anymore because he has passed away. So um, this is just a mess right now. I don't even know why it's like this. And then I have cardboard up here because the chinchillas try to chew on these little plastic things. So um, they like to walk on here, but I'm gonna clean out the hamster cage soon. Over here, I just have this little jumble of a bunch of random stuff. Um, it's not organized at all. And then I have this shelf here. Um, so on the top, there's just some random stuff. Um, I have this camera. I filmed some of my videos on this. I haven't filmed a mini yet. Um, I don't even know why this is here. It's like a little hamster hide. Over here, I have um, hamster food and treats. And down here, I just have a few chinchilla treats. I have a lot more in the other thing down there, so I don't really know. It's not very organized where I keep those. And then in here, there's just some more chinchilla and hamster like toys. I just keep them in that box. And then I have some extra hay in here and their sand bath is in here and then this is another thing of extra sand um i used to have my little hamster carrier um sitting right here but i actually don't have that in there right now i don't really remember why i can't find it but yeah and then i just have my tripod over here sometimes i use that to film yeah that's basically the room i hope i got to everything oh there's a sweeper what is that called broom oh that is a heater for the winter it gets really cold in here thank you so much for watching um it's very much oh my god my i mean it's a <gasps> oh, i'm losing my voice <clears throat> it's very much covered in cardboard cardboard in this room because of the chinchillas they have destroyed many of the walls um underneath the cardboard that is the animal room right now it's just chinchillas i don't really know what my next pet will be I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!